digression, the two are finally on their way to their ultimate destination, New York City. But Wesley promised that he would stop along the major cities on their way. So naturally, after a lengthy plot detour, the two take a physical detour to Los Angeles. From San Francisco. Los Angeles from San Francisco. That's a 300 mile drive that is in no way in the same direction as New York City. I mean, I get why they did it, and I certainly didn't expect them to stop off at Reno, but this kind of shit always bugged the fuck out of me. You know what? If the anime can have a 20 minute digression, then so can I. How the fuck did Tony Stark drive from Tennessee to Miami in less than a day? It's bullshit enough that his suit could travel at even faster speeds, but that I can let slide. Arc reactor and shit, I get it. But when he's in a goddamn car and still arrives at the mansion when it's still daylight out, that just smacks of lazy convenience. Oh, and speaking of lazy convenience, what the fuck was the president doing in Miami on Christmas Eve? Or how about the fact that Tony's panic attack subplot immediately dropped from the face of the earth just because a smart-mouthed brat told him to nut up and fix the situation? What the fuck did Tony think would happen when he blurted out his home address as a personal challenge to the Mandarin? What's the point of being Iron Man when you can remotely pilot the Iron Man suits? And don't even get me started on the bullshit that is- And how do the beam sabers work if they're in the vacuum of outer fucking space? What was I talking about again?